On our final day of DC, let's see what the downtown area is like. Follow me to get a glimpse of the city and the vibe within, only on the Epic Travel Adventures. This is the National Gallery of Art, which is the National Art Museum. Established in 1937, the National Art Museum has over 75,000 prints. Last year, in 2020, it ranked 21st most visited art museum in the world. And the best thing? It is free of charge. In front of you is the Smithsonian National Museum of Natural History, which was opened in 1910. It is the largest natural history collection in the world with over 145 million specimens and artifacts. Last year it was 14th most visited museum in the world and the most visited natural history museum in the world. This is the headquarters of the U.S. Department of Commerce, located in the Herbert Clark Hoover Building. Built in 1932, it was named after the 31st U.S. President. U.S. Department of Commerce promotes economic growth. By the way, Washington DC, sitting on the Potomac River, is the capital city located on the east coast of the USA, bordering the states of Maryland and Virginia. It has a population of over 700,000 people and is one of the most visited cities in the US. In fact, in 2018, almost 24 million people visited DC.
This is the US Department of Treasury. Built between 1836 and 1869, the building was designated as a National Historic Landmark in 1972. Did you know that DC was founded in 1791 and was named after George Washington, one of the founding fathers and the first US president? This is a statue of General Andrei Kosciuszko located on the H Street. Andrei was a Polish-Lithuanian military leader who fought along the US in the American Revolutionary War against Great Britain. Looking through the fence down the Lafayette Square, you can see the north side of the White House. We're looking right on the family dining room. On the left is the East Wing and the right is the Oval Office. The White House, completed in 1800, is the official residence and the workplace of the US President.
Can you guess who that is? That is Albert Einstein who was one of the greatest theoretical physicists in the world. He developed the theory of relativity and came up with his famous E equals mc squared equation which facilitated the way to the atomic bomb. Next, let's head to the west coast of the USA and explore Kirkland, a city right outside Seattle. So stay tuned only on the epic travel adventures. And if you want to see more awesome videos, then make sure to follow, subscribe, like, and of course hit that bell down below so that you do not miss any of my new content. See you in my next video.